Deep in the icy outlands of our solar system, a celestial dance unfolds. Orbiting the giant planet Neptune, we find Triton, a moon shrouded in mystery. Unlike most moons in our solar system, Triton travels in the opposite direction of its planet's rotation. This retrograde orbit hints at a past more dramatic than most. It suggests that Triton was not born alongside Neptune but was captured from the icy depths of the Kuiper Belt. Triton's surface is a canvas of nitrogen ice, painted with streaks of dark material. This alien landscape is sculpted by nitrogen geysers that erupt from beneath the surface, spewing plumes of nitrogen gas and ice particles high into the thin atmosphere. These geysers are a testament to the moon's internal heat, a sign that Triton is far from a dead and frozen world. But Triton's true secrets lie hidden beneath its icy shell. Scientists believe that a vast ocean of liquid water may exist deep below the surface warmed by tidal forces and the decay of radioactive elements within Triton's core. This subsurface ocean if it exists could potentially harbor life, making Triton one of the most exciting targets in the search for extraterrestrial life. To unlock the mysteries of this enigmatic moon, scientists have turned to the James Webb Space Telescope, the most powerful telescope ever built. With its advanced infrared capabilities, JWST is providing us with an unprecedented view of Triton, peering through the moon's hazy atmosphere and revealing the secrets of its surface and potential subsurface ocean. Triton stands out as an enigma in our solar system. It is a cosmic rule breaker, orbiting Neptune in the opposite direction of the planet's spin, a phenomenon known as retrograde orbit. This peculiar characteristic strongly suggests that Triton was not born in the same swirling cloud of gas and dust that gave birth to Neptune and its other moons. Instead, scientists believe that Triton originated in the distant icy realms of the Kuiper Belt, a region beyond Neptune populated by remnants from the early solar system. This region is home to countless icy bodies, some of which, like Pluto, are large enough to be considered dwarf planets. At some point in the distant past, a cosmic encounter, perhaps a close encounter with another massive object, disrupted Triton's orbit and sent it hurtling inward towards the Sun. Neptune, with its powerful gravity, captured Triton, ensnaring it in its gravitational embrace. This capture event had profound consequences for both Neptune and Triton. Triton's arrival likely disrupted Neptune's original satellite system, scattering some moons outward and sending others crashing into the giant planet. Triton itself was also affected, its orbit becoming tidally locked to Neptune, meaning that the same side of Triton always faces the planet. Despite its violent past, Triton has settled into a state of relative equilibrium. Its surface is a testament to its unique history, a frozen landscape sculpted by a combination of internal geological processes and external influences, such as impacts from comets and asteroids. Imagine a telescope so powerful that it can detect the faint heat signature of a bumblebee on the moon. That's the extraordinary capability of the James Webb Space Telescope, humanity's most advanced eye on the cosmos. JWS doesn't just see the universe, it feels it, detecting the infrared radiation emitted by every object in the cosmos. Unlike visible light, which is what our eyes perceive, infrared radiation is a form of light that we experience as heat. Everything in the universe, from stars and galaxies to planets and moons, emits infrared radiation. By detecting this radiation, JWS can peer through clouds of gas and dust that obscure our view in visible light, revealing hidden objects and processes that would otherwise remain invisible. JWST's infrared vision is particularly well suited to studying objects in the outer solar system like Triton. These distant worlds are incredibly faint, reflecting only a tiny fraction of the sun's light. However, they emit a significant amount of infrared radiation, making them ideal targets for JWST's sensitive instruments. Moreover, JWST's infrared capabilities allow it to study the chemical composition of objects in the universe. Different molecules absorb and emit infrared radiation at specific wavelengths, creating a unique spectral fingerprint. By analyzing the infrared spectrum of an object, JWST can identify the molecules present, providing valuable insights into its composition and chemistry.
unmasking Triton, JWist's infrared gaze. Could life exist beneath Triton's ice? The possibility is truly fascinating. Triton has a subsurface ocean that could harbor life, much like the icy moons of Jupiter and Saturn. The JWST, with its advanced instruments, will help us understand the potential for life in these hidden oceans. As we explore the outer reaches of our solar system, Triton stands out as a key target. Its retrograde orbit and unique geological features make it a captivating subject of study. The James Webb Space Telescope will provide unprecedented insights, revealing secrets that have eluded us for decades. We are on the brink of a new era of discovery. With the JWST, we can peer deeper into the cosmos and uncover the mysteries of distant worlds like Triton. This is not just about scientific curiosity, it's about understanding our place in the universe and the potential for life beyond Earth. As we conclude our journey, we invite you to stay tuned for more updates on the incredible findings from the James Webb Space Telescope. Your curiosity and support drive these explorations. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share your thoughts in the comments. Who knows what we might discover next? Thank you for watching.